Hello everyone, I'm Nabila and today I'm going to demonstrate on wearing spiral and triangular bandage. Before we start the procedure, sanitize our hand with the sanitizer. Take the patient's hand and expose the limb and check the circulation at a point below the point of injury such as the wrist or foot. Position the body part to be bandaged in a normal resting position. Lay the end of the bandage on the bottom of the limb to be wrapped and at an angle so one corner of the bandage will not be covered when the bandage is brought around the limb. Wrap the bandage completely around the limb twice and pass the apex. Fold the apex over the bandage so that it lies on the top of the bandage and then continue wrapping the bandage around the limb a third time covering the apex with the turn. Continue wrapping until the entire portion of the limb has been wrapped. Secure the wrap with two circular turns at the top and then tape, clip or tie the end of the bandage in a position that is easy to reach. Check circulation below the bandage. If blood circulation was not impaired before the bandage was applied, but is now is impaired, loosen the bandage and apply the bandage again. Applying triangular bandage to the patient. Ask the patient to hold their arm across their chest and support the arm while you work. Put the bandage under the arm. And also around the back of the neck. Put the other half of the bandage over the arm to meet at the shoulder and tie into a knot. Tuck the loose ends of the bandage, use a pin or just tie into a knot. If you are using a triangular bandage to support a lower limb or large dressing, fold it in half horizontally so the point of the triangle touch the middle of the long edge. Lastly, fold it in half again in the same direction. That's all. Thank you for watching.